10 types of counter drone technology to detect and stop drones you didn't know existed. Counter the drone threat with counter UAS technology. The continued growth of the consumer drone market presents new challenges for the aviation industry. Whether it's a careless amateur pilot or a deliberate attack, the drone threat comes in many shapes and sizes. To help you meet these challenges head on, we present to you an overview of the counter drone technology types you can easily buy. You might also know it as anti-drone or counter UAS CUAS technology. Our focus is on the latest countermeasures. So, if you need to implement or are thinking about implementing a counter drone solution, then this YouTube channel, High Tech Gadgets channel, is the best channel for you to learn about counter drone technology types. We are giving you an unbiased look at the best counter drone and counter UAS technology, including a helpful breakdown of the advantages and disadvantages of each solution. We've even provided links to vendors for you. There are two categories of anti-drone technologies we are looking at, monitoring equipment and drone countermeasures. Drone monitoring equipment. Drone monitoring equipment can be passive, simply looking or listening, or active, emitting a signal and analyzing what comes back, and can perform several functions. A. Detection. B. Classification or identification. C. Locating and tracking. D. Alerting. Not all equipment performs all the above functionality at the same time. For example, detection means the counter UAS technology can simply detect that something is there. But detection alone isn't enough. That's why classification is useful. Technology that separates drones from other types of objects, like birds and planes, for example. One step further is identification. Some equipment can identify a particular model of drone, or even identify the drone's or controller's digital fingerprint, like a MAC address. This level of identification can be handy for prosecution purposes. Being alerted that a drone is present somewhere in the vicinity is already useful. But your situational awareness and ability to deploy countermeasures are greatly enhanced if you know the drone's and or the controller's exact location. Some counter UAS technology even allows you to track the drone's location in real time. There are four main types of drone monitoring equipment. A. Radio frequency RF analyzers. B. Acoustic sensors microphones. C. Optical sensors cameras. D. Radar. Now starting with radar type. 1. Radar. A device that uses radio energy to detect an object. Drone detection radar or counter UAS radar sends out a signal and uses the reflection as it bounces off an object to measure its direction and distance position. Most radars send their radio signal as a burst, then listen for the echo. Almost all radars are designed not to pick up small targets. They're designed for large object tracking, like passenger aircraft. However, specialist counter UAS technology includes radar that tracks smaller objects, like drones, with ease. Advantages are as follows. Long range, constant tracking, highly accurate localization. Can handle hundreds of targets simultaneously. Can track all drones regardless of autonomous flight and visual conditions day, night, fog, etc. Disadvantages. Detection range depends on drone size. Most don't distinguish birds from drones. Requires a transmission license and frequency checks to prevent interference. Vendors. Drone detection radar, IRIS is an example and it isn't like standard radars. For starters, IRIS has specifically been built to track drones. Featuring 360 degree azimuth and 60 degree elevation coverage, IRIS provides early warning of approaching drones from any direction, in full 3D. What makes IRIS unique is that it's a counter UAS micro Doppler radar. Micro Doppler radar detects speed differences within moving objects. For example, a drone's rotor. This enables IRIS to distinguish between drones and other small, fast moving objects, like birds, reducing false alarms. It can also detect autonomous and hovering drones and track multiple targets simultaneously. Lightweight and easy to deploy, IRIS integrates seamlessly with your existing drone detection systems. 2. Radio Frequency RF Analyzers RF analyzers consist of one or more antennas to receive radio waves and a processor to analyze the RF spectrum. 
They are used to detect radio communication between a drone and its controller. Some systems can identify the more common drone makes and models, while others can even identify the MAC addresses of the drone and controller if the drone uses Wi-Fi for communication. This is especially useful for prosecution purposes, proving that a particular drone and controller were active at a certain time and location. Some high-end systems can also triangulate the drone and its controller when using multiple radio units spread far apart. Advantages Low cost can detect and sometimes identify multiple drones and controllers. It's also passive, so you don't need a license to operate. Some can triangulate drone and controller positions. Disadvantages. Doesn't always locate and track drones. Can't detect autonomous drones, less effective in crowded RF areas. Typically short range. Difficult to detect drones controlled over 5G networks. Successful RF identification also depends on libraries that require continuous reverse engineering and updating. This takes time, during which UAS with modified protocols go unseen. Subscriptions to library updates can be expensive. Vendors. Vendors of radio frequency analyzers include Roden Schwartz, Aronia, Dedrone, and CERBAIR. 3. Optical sensors cameras. Optical sensors collect light at a range of wavelengths, including visible and infrared, as well as thermal radiation, to detect drones day and night. Recent advances in optical sensor technology have improved resolution, and thereby range, and processing power in the form of AI-powered detection, tracking, and classification. Advantages Provide visuals on the drone and its potential payload. Can record images as forensic evidence for use in prosecution. Disadvantages. Difficult to use for detection by itself. High false alarm rates. Performs poorly in dark, fog, etc. Vendors. There are a lot of them. 4. Acoustic sensors microphones. This type of counter UAS technology involves using a microphone or microphone array lots of microphones to detect the sound made by a drone and calculate its direction. It makes use of multiple microphone arrays for rough triangulation. Advantages. Detects all drones within the near field, including those operating autonomously without RF emissions. Detects drones in the ground clutter where other technologies can struggle. Great gap filler in areas outside the line of sight of other sensors. Highly mobile and quickly deployable. Completely passive. Disadvantages. Doesn't work as well in noisy environments. Has a very short range max. 300 minus 500 meters. Vendors. Vendors include Squarehead Technologies. Drone Countermeasures. The second group of anti-drone technologies are the drone countermeasures. Drone countermeasures include technologies that aim at a. Physically destroying the drone. b. Neutralizing the drone. c. Taking control of the drone. It's important to note that although the technology is available, current regulations in most countries forbid the use of any of the following drone countermeasures to neutralize drones. Exceptions are sometimes made for military or law enforcement agencies. 5. Radio frequency jammers. This is a static, mobile, or handheld device that transmits a large amount of RF energy towards the drone, masking the controller signal. This results in one of four scenarios, depending on the drone. A. The drone makes a controlled landing in its current position. B. The drone returns to its pre-programmed home location which could be set to a target position instead of home. C. The drone falls uncontrolled to the ground. D. The drone flies off in a random direction. Advantages. Medium cost. Non-kinetic neutralization. Disadvantages. Short range. Can affect and jam other radio communications. May result in unpredictable drone behavior and can unintentionally send the drone to its target. Vendors include TRD, HP Wust, and a drone defender. 6. GPS spoofers. GPS spoofers send a new signal to the target drones, replacing the communication signal it uses to navigate. In this way, it spoofs the drone into thinking it's somewhere else. By dynamically altering the GPS coordinates in real time, the spoofer can control the drone's position. 
Once the spoofer gains control, they can direct the drone to a safe zone, for example. However, GPS spoofers can inadvertently disrupt other systems beyond the target drone. Because of the risks, GPS spoofers are primarily used as a drone countermeasure on the battlefield. They aren't as common for civilian operations. Advantages. Medium cost. Non-kinetic neutralization. Disadvantages. Short range. Can affect and jam other radio communications. Vendors include Regulus. Regulus manufactures GPS spoofers specifically for drone defense. 7. High Power Microwave HPM devices. High Power Microwave HPM devices generate an electromagnetic pulse EMP capable of disrupting electronic devices. The EMP interferes with radio links and disrupts or even destroys the electronic circuitry inside drones plus any other electronic device within range due to the damaging voltage and currents it creates. HPM devices may include an antenna to focus the EMP in a certain direction, reducing potential collateral damage. Advantages. Effectively stops drones within range. Non-kinetic. Disadvantages. High cost. Risk of unintentionally disrupting communications or destroying other electronic devices in the area. Can cause the drone to switch off instantly so it falls, uncontrolled, to the ground. Vendors includes Deal Defense. Deal Defense provides an HPEM solution. 8. Nets and Net Guns. This rudimentary but effective counter UAS technology involves using a net to stop the drone by prohibiting the rotor blades. There are three main delivery methods. A. Net cannons fired from the ground, can be handheld, shoulder launched, or turret mounted. Anywhere from 20 meters to 300 meters effectiveness can be used with or without a parachute for controlled descent of the captured drone. b. Net cannon fired from another drone, overcomes the limited range of a net cannon on the ground. Can be difficult to capture another moving drone. Normally used with a parachute for controlled descent of the captured drone. c. Hanging net deployed from a net drone, a friendly, net carrying drone is maneuvered towards the rogue drone. The net drone will normally be capable of either carrying the rogue drone to a safe zone or, if it's too heavy, can release the captured drone with or without a parachute for a controlled descent. Advantages. Physically captures drones, good for forensics and prosecution. Ground-launched net cannons are semi-automatic with high accuracy. Drone-deployed nets have a long range and low risk of collateral damage. Disadvantages. As a kinetic solution, it can result in debris depending on parachute options. Drone-deployed nets can be imprecise and have long reload times. Ground-launched nets have a short range. Drone-mounted net guns often struggle to intercept and neutralize hostile drones that fly aggressively or evasively due to inertia. Vendors Fortum Technologies Drone Hunter 700 supports three net gun attachments that enable it to stop drones of almost any size. Additionally, OpenWorks Engineering offers both shoulder-mounted and turret-mounted net cannons. 9. High-Energy Lasers A high-powered optical device which produces an extremely focused beam of light, or laser beam. The laser destroys the drone's structure and or electronics. Advantages Long-range, low-cost to kill solution. Physically stops and destroys target drones to neutralize threats quickly doesn't require physical ammunition, like nets. Disadvantages. Large system. Mostly experimental. Risk of collateral damage to other airborne targets and people at ground level, especially to eyes. Vendors include. Lockheed Martin and Raytheon. 10. Cyber Takeover Systems. Cyber Takeover, or Cyber Takedown, systems are a relatively new counter-drone technology. They passively detect radio frequency transmissions emitted by drones to identify the drone's serial number and locate the pilot's position using AI. If the operator recognizes the drone as a threat, they can send a signal to hack the drone, assume control, and direct it to a safe location. Advantages. Precise, with a low risk of collateral damage. Lightweight and configurable for both static and mobile applications automatically captures incident data vital for forensic investigation effective against both piloted and autonomous drones disadvantages new and largely untested technology 
relies on an up-to-date library of commercial drones, making it less effective against homemade or state-developed drones. Vendors include Defend Solutions, Enforce Air System. Defend Solutions Enforce Air System is one of the market leaders for counter-drone takeover technology. Integrating Counter UAS Technology It's more than likely that the best counter-drone solution for you is going to be a mix of the above technologies. Which mix exactly? Well, that's going to be dependent on your specific use case. Thank you for watching High Tech Gadgets channel. Remember to subscribe, like, comment and share. See you in our next production.